peace, 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 and love, divine blessings to everybody on this beautiful, what's today? Today, Tuesday, beautiful Tuesday. We lose track of time when you don't have a, when you don't have a schedule and you kind of, you know, just do what you want to do. But, um, I'm going to wait for a little bit more people to get up on here before we talk about this Bitcoin and uh, cryptocurrency. Is it going to be crashing? What is going on with the system? The price is dropping. Everything's in the red. Bitcoin was down about, I think it went down as low as 6000 yesterday. So, um, let me get some people on the call before we dive deep into this. I hope everybody is having a blessed, prosperous morning. This beautiful, beautiful Tuesday. Let's add some people real quick. And if you have some uh, people that are interested in this whole this Bitcoin crashing, you can add them to the call as well, too. Just adding some people. Alright, cool. So we can go ahead and pretty much start. Alright, peace. So, um, I'm going to just give my a little quick opinion real quick on uh, cryptocurrency and Bitcoin and is it crashing. So, for everybody that's new to the market, um, I'm also new to the market myself, but I have been doing a lot of studying and research. And that's what it really takes is to do your own studies and research to really see what's going on with this whole cryptocurrency Bitcoin thing. And so, um... Everything is new right now, y'all. Everything is new, and um, there's something called, like, retracement. So, right now, what's happening is all the people who know what's going on with Bitcoin, they are putting out all these scare tactics to stop people from buying cryptocurrency, Bitcoin, so the price could go down, so they can grab it all on the low ski, you know what I'm saying, grab it when it's low, so when the price shoot back up again, because when the price shoot back, let me tell y'all, when the price shoot back up on Bitcoin, it's going to be even twice, maybe even three times more than what it was when it first came back out just a couple of months ago. Bitcoin has been here since I think about 2008, y'all. So this is something that has gained value over the years and has rose and has fell. I spoke with somebody last week. Shout out to Maria, who said she got back into Bitcoin back in, like, I think 2012, 2013. Correct me if I'm, if I'm uh, wrong, Maria, if you're on the call. But um, she got back in during that time and was able to live off her Bitcoin um, for a couple of months because she got in when Bitcoin was low. And so when the value went back up, she was banking because she had multiple. She didn't just invest in one whole coin she had multiple coins so she was able to bank on it so sometimes we got to look for the uh, long-term goal and get out of this quick money fast mindset like gotta get quick money i gotta have money now 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 money now is cool of course you know things gotta be paid you know i understand um but to also just really put your mind on and i know we live in the now but you have to kind of Think a little bit of a head, because even if you're not going to be here in this now moment, you got family, you got kids, you know, you got people that you need to leave things to when you're not here in this world. So don't be scared and, and, and dogging out cryptocurrency and Bitcoin because of the market going down. The market always goes down in things. If you ever pay attention to stocks and stuff, markets go down and markets go up. That's just what it does, y'all. Everything goes up and down. There's always a polar opposite to something which is still the same whole all at the same time so um if i was you if you could afford to get a whole bitcoin get a whole bitcoin i'm not saying all coins are going to the top i don't feel like all it's shit i don't even know how many different cryptocurrency coins there is out right now today and more coming in every day more and more so the real thing to do is do your research study which coins rock with you like which coins you feel good with um you know maybe holding because you feel like 
later on down the line is going to be booming. But also learn how to trade. Learn how to trade cryptocurrency. Learning how to trade cryptocurrency or any form of currency, you'll be able to get money daily. Because you, you have a strategy. You know how to trade. So you don't have to just sit and sit and sit on these different coins that are not going to go anywhere. I'm not saying all coins, but some coins that you know you have on your Binance or your Bitrix, you don't really know if they're really going to go anywhere. So, of course, you know, get the ones you rock with, hold them down, but don't be afraid of this market right now. Don't be afraid of the dip. You're supposed to buy when it's low. Why would you want to buy when the market is high? Why would you want to buy when the market is high? You want to buy it when the market is low because it's at this lowest point it's gonna go back up so if you can afford it invest in a whole bitcoin if you can if you can't get you some shares in bitcoins start getting into these mining companies if you can't afford to buy it mine bitcoin mine ethereum mine uh litecoin so um you know if you if you want any help or need any information on you know mining or learning how to trade cryptocurrency and learning how to trade cryptocurrency by professionals by people who have been trading for years not no average joe on the street not even by me you're not about to learn how to trade cryptocurrency by me i'm still learning myself but what i do know is that i see the potential in it i see that it's important to have the skill to know how to trade because once you know how to trade and you're trading in forex that's daily income i don't care if you only made five dollars from a trade today and then the next day you make five and then the next day you make two like that stuff adds up y'all it adds up so we have to like really stop looking at the the quantity of the number and just know that you know, compounding what you have can go a long way. So don't get discouraged. You're like, I don't know how to read graphs. I don't have time to trade. Let me tell you, the company that I am in, they will give you all the tools necessary to learn how to become a trader. Even if you don't have all day to trade, we have products that will trade on auto for you. So I'm sitting here really sharing this message with you guys because I'm like, damn, I woke up yesterday and I woke up today. I was like, fuck, it's a blessing. I haven't worked for anybody for like four years. I can just get up out of my bed and have and own my own time. I don't have to wake up and be like, damn, I got to be to work soon. I got to get up and do this and do all these different things. I'm able to take control over my own time. You know what I mean? Like, I'm able to take control. I'm able to step inside more and more every day of my freedom because I'm not being controlled and I'm not having to be to work and deal with people I don't want to deal with. And all these things that some people go through on a day-to-day -day basis, y'all. We got to get, get out of our own way and really get out this fiery, scary, scammy, everything's a scam, everything's a pyramid, I'm safe and I'm secure right where I am. Some of the wealthiest people didn't make it wealthy by being safe and secure. They became wealthy by jumping out and getting out there and, 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 and diversifying their portfolio. You never put your eggs in one basket. Because what happens is when you put your eggs in one basket and then you get burnt, you be mad as hell. We're going to talk about the company. It's the company's fault and this and that. No, you don't never put all your eggs in one basket. You have different, 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 you know, different pockets where you can accumulate passive income, y'all. I don't think y'all know the freedom of passive income. You don't have to really do anything. Once you set yourself up in a way and have your passive income coming in, you, every time that you breathe in air, you're getting paid and you're able to travel. You're able to get these things for your children. You're able to have, uh, you know, if you want to send them to college, you know, you're able to have that money for them. So, you know, let's get out of our own way. Let's stop making excuses and let's come together as a community, as a community and and cycle this wealth around. So um, 
I ain't gonna be too long out here. I'm at the gym actually. Um, about to work it out. So, um, if anybody has any questions or anything, I'm definitely here to help you. If you want to know more information on Forex, and um, you know, you want to, you know, hear it from uh, people that's doing it even more bigger than me. Hey, the option is there as well. So, everybody have a wonderful, prosperous day. If anybody is feeling down today, I send you my joy. I send you my happiness because I have so much of it that I can share it with you guys. So I'm just sending out love and bliss and healing energy to everybody out there. Peace and love, fam.